Hello. Okay. So today, something a little different. I'm going to um, varnish a painting that's been dry for quite a while. I think this is. Uh, it's got to be at least six months, maybe even a year. So this is a, a portrait I did of my wife and it's been sort of stacked up in the corner of the office for a long time and I think it's time to varnish. So I'm going to use retouching varnish. Um, it's a little bit more forgiving and I'm going to see how it looks and then if I like the look of it, it needs to be done soon because um, it's gathering dust and dirt at the moment and um, well in the long run it'll just get grubby and I'd rather it was varnished and then the dirt can stick to the varnish and not the actual painting because the varnish can be removed and revarnished at a later date. So the first thing you have to do is just give it a little, make sure there aren't any hairs, bits of dirt, you see there's a brush hair there. Make sure there's no dirt on it. Now let me just see how the focus is. So as you can see, this painting isn't too bad. The colours haven't sunken you can see there's a, a kind of general gentle sheen to it but some paintings you'll see some colors are much more matte than others um, but in this case it's all fairly even the dress where the paint is thicker on these kind of ribbony areas well they're kind of i don't know what you call them but uh, i use more paint on these areas and they are more shiny. So I'm hoping the varnish will kind of even out that kind of sheen. Okay, let's do it. I've uh, got one of these food containers. I put a little bit of silver foil in there so that I can have a little well. And I'm using a really cheap brush. Sort of a pound, I think it was. That's it. Simple as that. Now I'm going to go back over it for a little bit more just to ensure that everywhere is covered. I'm just using the uh, angle of the light to make sure I have covered everywhere. Trying not to get um, bubbles by doing it slowly. That's it. I'll see how it looks when it's dry. Well, let me show, uh, hold it up to you. So the colours are much more 
I guess you'd say richer. Obviously there is a more of a reflection now, but the the overall colour of the painting, it was quite matte before, now it's much more well obviously it's more glossy, but it's much richer. The colours are better. And that's it. Okay.